I just realized that I lost one of my earrings in all my changing room visits today. I have no idea where as I hit quite a few change rooms and I'm really quite upset because my parents got it from overseas and it was one of my favorites and I didn't even wear it that often. Ugh. Welcome back to my channel. My name is Danzy and welcome to today's video. So today's video is all about plus size pyjamas. I was literally walking past Pete Alexander and that smell drew me in and I thought, you know what, you could always do with new PJs. I love pyjamas and I love them to be comfortable and also look cute and I thought, let me show you guys what's out in the shops in case you guys were after something new. So I thought while I'm out there, let me look at some Christmassy ones and some regular ones and these are all the new summer PJs that are out now. So I hit a couple of stores and and I tried what I could on in the change rooms so you guys could see how they look like on. Now I went to Target, Peter Alexander and Big W. I wanted to do a few more stores. However, I walked into Kmart and there was literally like nothing in there. There was a few odds and end things, but nothing that kind of drew me to actually want to try on and show you guys. And I didn't even recall anything there because there was absolutely nothing. Could have been the Kmart I was at, but there was nothing. Next, I also went over to Best and Less just to have a look because I know they're not utilizing the change rooms at the moment and they always have some cute PJs happening uh, they do have this really cute set it's like a little gingerbread man and it's like a family set where I believe there's some for like everyone in the family really really cute it's that satin material I'm not a huge fan of sleeping in that fabric but I feel like it's really cute especially for like Christmas pictures they also had a few like singlets uh, with cute bottoms that go with it there's short shorts if you wanted to there's t-shirt style so many to choose from I really like best and less like they're comfy they have good sizing as well and the prices are pretty decent as well <laughs> so whilst I was in Target the other day I thought I'd try on a few PJs now I have quite a few pyjamas from Target mainly because I think they have cute like patterns and I've got these really cute doggy ones from last year and all of my like sleep tops are from Target because they have that like shelf bra love that although I still sleep with a bra but if you didn't want to sleep with a bra they are fantastic so I tried on two lots I thought I'll try on ones that are like a matching pair and the first ones I tried on were this like purpley one because you know purple is my favorite color and I, the color really drew me now the shelf top I love the color it's a nice lilac -y color it goes up to a 3xl but on the rack they only had an xl so I tried that on it does fit me normally I usually get the 2xl in the top uh they all pretty fit decently but I like it a little bit roomier for sleeping this one still fit love the style like comfy the pants were really cute they're like a soft purple with flowers the whole set together looked super cute they were very very comfortable I tried the pants on in a double X as that was the bigger size I had there I'm pretty sure they go up to a triple X as well if you want them a little bit roomier they're so comfy they're exactly the same style of the ones that I already have so I know they're nice and comfy they're nice and long if you like long ones and they're not a jog on the bottom they just kind of taper in they've got elastic they've got pockets that's my favorite thing pajamas need to have pockets because I need to pull my phone when I'm walking around the house the bottoms retail for $18 and the shelf bra is $12 so next I came across this like dusty pink, well it's not really a set, I call it a set, but they're separates. So I also tried on the top which is like a dusty pink and I tried that one in a 3XL and that one fit me nice and fine. It was a lot like roomier than the XL and then I thought these cute little like pants with the little flowers went really well with the top they were also in a 3xl as you guys could probably tell there's not a huge difference between the 2x and the 3x but they're nice and soft and fit really well and i really like these pretty much same style as the ones before i just thought i'll show you guys like a different kind of pattern and how that looks they also retail same price the shelf top was 12 dollars and the pants were 18. So I strolled on over to Peter Alexander. That smell of that store, I love it. They have these candles. I know I'm getting off track here, but they have these candles that are like Glasshouse X Peter Alexander and they all smell so good. They have a banana one, smells so good. They even have like a movie night one. I really want one of those candles and I'm probably going to get one for Christmas because I was just like, I had to sniff all of them. So I wandered on over to the plus section and there was quite a few you know pyjama tops and I was like let me try some on because I just love going to that store I love all the slippers from there too just 
such a cute store. I think it's the dog influence that kind of gets me. So firstly, I tried on a sleep dress and I love the pink. So it was a pink and white stripe and it had a little like sausage dog on the bottom. This was really cute. Now I tried this on in a 3X. Fit me really well, nice and comfortable. It just has that really nice feeling to it. Uh, it's nice and soft. It's airy, great for sleeping. It's got sleeves. There's a little pocket up the top here. Really look nice and comfortable. Now, I did have my shapewear underneath because I really couldn't be bothered taking them off. But you guys can tell it's still quite roomy. Now, this one retails for $89.95. And whilst they are a lot dearer at Peter Alexander compared to some of the department stores, the quality is actually really nice. So next I saw a Christmas sleep top and I thought, okay, well, I guess a sleep dress. I thought I need to try this on because I loved the pattern. Really cute little like sausage dogs in like Christmas mode. So cute. Now I tried this on in a 3XL and it fit me just fine. It was nice and roomy, uh, really pretty as well. I absolutely love the design and the length was good. I, it was just great for sleeping in. Now this one retails for $79.95. And lastly, I saw this cute little set of this like matching shirt and shorts and it said family set. So I didn't actually have a look, but in the store there must have been matching like for the whole family to have like a striped little set for Christmas or for anything. I love the hot pink stripes, just looks so good. And there was also like a little, it looked like a bandana that looked like a crown. Maybe it was an eye mask, I'm not sure, but it looks like a crown kind of bandana. Now, normally I don't like sleep shorts because I always find them too short. But these ones at Peter Alexander were such a great length. Like they were short, but they weren't like too short where I wouldn't be able to walk around in them. Nice and comfy. I like the button-up shirt. It just looked nice and cool and like fresh and updated. I tried these both on in a 3X. It's actually, I said it comes as one. Uh, and I did try it on a 3X and I feel like it fit me just fine. The shorts, they don't come up super high, but for sleeping in, you know, you don't really want them coming up high. <laughs> The shorts even had a pocket, which I absolutely loved. These were adorable and they retail for $109. Next, I wandered on over to Big W because I know Big W has some pretty decent sleepwear there. And I thought, let me try out some of the Christmas ones because who doesn't want Christmas PJs? I mean, I know you can pretty much wear them for a month, but then, you know, you can just pack them up and wear them next year. Or really, you could wear them all year round if you wanted to. So the first one I tried on was the Grinch. Now, this was a t-shirt and a matching short set. And I tried it on in a size 24. I feel like it fit me just fine. The shorts were nice and comfortable as well. It was cute. It was comfy. If you love shorts, perfect, like a cute little set. Uh, this one retails for $25. Pretty decent price for some like Christmas PJs, I would say. So next I saw this set that was like a friend set with a pink top. The pink always like catches my attention. So I thought, let me try them on. So it was like a pink t-shirt with sort of three quarter, really comfy that they're not cotton, but they're like a bit of like a stretchy jersey sort of fabric. Usually the fabric that I don't mind for sleeping because it has a bit of room to like move around in. This set was really cute. I also tried that on in a size 24. I feel like there was plenty of room to move, to be comfy, to lie around, to do exercises if you had to in it. Love the coloring. The sleeves were really nice. I really, really liked this one and you could wear it all year round as well. This one retails for $30. So next, another Christmas one, and I thought I'd try on one with a singlet because it gets really hot here. So it's nice to sometimes wear just a singlet and some like three quarter sort of style pants. Now, the top fit me pretty decently. I mean, it's not the greatest fit, but it was nice. But I really didn't like the way the bottom stayed. I just felt like they were a little boxy. Just, I mean, comfortable, yes. I just didn't really like the look of them. So I definitely wouldn't buy these. But they were only retail for $16. So I feel like they were just made really quickly and just something to kind of have for Christmas. I don't think it would be something that would be like long lasting uh, due to probably the price and the way that they were made. They're not that flattering. Uh, but are pyjamas really flattering? I don't really think so. They're, they're for comfort anyway but it's not a bad set not really for me but pretty like comfortable I would say I also tried that one on in a size 24 
And lastly, I saw this like Australiana Christmas kind of shirt and short set and I thought, let me try some on. So they also came in, they came in a pink and a blue and I thought I'd try on the blue. Actually, there was no sizing in the pink where I was at. So I grabbed them in a the blue. Now, I'm not sure if the blue was more designed for males, just for the kind of style that they were, but I think that unisex so and i really love that they were australiana like they had little koalas with like little christmas hats and candy canes and the bottle brush and cockatoos they were just really adorable there was no stretch or anything to them and pajamas don't in that sort of style they normally don't and i grabbed these in a 3x however they were too small for me now i did manage to get it on the shorts were super duper tight i probably couldn't sit in them and that's why i'm saying i feel like they were designed more for men they weren't really designed for hips because normally like i I would find a 3x in like a store like big w no problem to fit in but i don't fit into a men's 3x because they make them quite narrow because men typically don't have bigger hips like the ladies do um but they were cute anyway to look at so it did, wouldn't have mattered i think if i got it in the pink either i'm pretty sure they went up to a 4x but i i just like the look of how it is i even think the 4x probably wouldn't have fit me uh, probably either just for the design that they were made but I love the Australiana bit of it. That was really cute. I mean, I guess I could always just wear like the shirt open, but then what would be the point? But if you want to go and check these out, um, maybe if you're shaped differently to me or you just want some like Australian stuff, have a look because they were like a little family set, I guess. Whatever sort of family you have, you guys can get kind of matching PJs. That would be cute. And that one retail for $20, so not too bad at all. And they were all the pyjamas that I tried on today. Every time when I go out looking for pyjamas, I just want to buy more and more. I feel like you can never have enough pyjamas. <laughs> and the funny thing is, I still hold on to my old ones, even though they're like old and should be thrown out. I still hold on to them just in case. And you know, sometimes when you just love a certain pair of PJs and you're just like, mm, I want them, I want to keep them. And then you probably should have thrown them out like two seasons ago. But uh, someone like me still holds on to stuff. I'm one of those people who pretty much puts my pyjamas on as soon as I possibly can. So I do spend quite a bit of time in them. Comment down below and let me know where you guys get your pyjamas from. What's, where's your favourite place? I like to kind of shop around everywhere. But my main choices are, are pretty much Peter Alexander and Target. I kind of like those. But I do have some from e everywhere, seriously. And best on less than everywhere because, you know... I love my PJs. And that is the end of today's video, guys. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, please don't hesitate to hit that subscribe button below and also that bell so you can get notified of when I upload new videos. And I will see you guys in the next one. Thank you so, so much for watching. Bye.